Kia ora, this is James. My morning ramble, currently an evening ramble on Wednesday, December 21st, 2022. Uh, inside the camper at the moment. Um, for those that are not America based and maybe watching this, friends, family, and otherwise, um, we've got a fairly substantial storm blizzard coming down coming down the pipeline um as i've mentioned the siberian express is pushing a lot of air and bad stuff snow and freezing cold temperatures and um it's kind of aiming to meet a, a whole bunch of water coming up from a from a storm from the south so um there was a lot of hoo-ha and talk the last few weeks about you know how bad this is going to be and it's you know, worse in, in decades or worse blizzards in 78 or um, whoever you you speak to, there's every manner of opinion on it. Um, like all these things, you know, you don't really know what the weather's going to do until the weather gets here. So um, we're, just, we're just kind of um, batting in the hatches, I guess, and, and we'll see how that actually pans out. Uh, Dawn's made it safely to Ohio um, and I'm in Tennessee with the dogs. Uh, finishing up my work week last day tomorrow and then uh, basically off Friday, Saturday, Sunday, Monday for four days for the Christmas break. Um, unfortunately those four days are also right smack bang when this blizzard hits so um, we're going to see how it, how it pans out. Um, we've kind of been lucky I guess and I don't want to jinx it with the weather here in our particular holler um but the uh you know weather is weather and um you have no control over it so we're just going to have to see what actually happens um i'm currently sitting in the trailer i mean it's not not super cold outside i think it's 43 degrees or something oh well, okay that's actually pretty cold but uh, i actually have the door open and, and the screen is pretty much just acting as a barrier and several windows are open around the place because the kerosene heater is on and it, it throws out a fairly substantial chunk of heat, to say the least. Um, so much so that, you know, I can actually have doors open and stuff. So I'm honestly a little bit curious to see how that's going to work and, and temperatures in the single digits with wind chill feeling like God knows what. So um, negative oh my god, I can't feel my face anymore, um, which is apparently a, a real temperature, just for those that, that, that weren't aware. But anyway, um, just a very quick one tonight, just to let people know that, that we're okay, that Dawn's okay, she's she's up with, with the kids in, in Ohio, and um, she'll be spending Christmas with them, and then back again uh, just, just before the new year, I guess, a day or two before, with another trailer load of stuff. Um... And in the meantime, I'm I'm winging it solo, um, and uh, we've, we're about as prepared as we can be in uh, in in the general scheme of things. Um, we'll just see what happens, and I'll just kind of keep people posted, and hopefully be able to make make calls and stuff. Um, I it's all subject to internet, um, and we're. We're um, we're subject to the vagaries of, of cell phone towers, so hopefully, uh, hopefully that they stay up in the ice and in conditions. Otherwise, I will I will be pretty much cut off uh, for a while. But anyways, um, that's pretty much the size of it from from me for now. Um, hope you're all keeping well, and when who's watching this and who's affected by the storm, please stay safe, stay warm. Um, you know. Get an extra supplies and stuff if you haven't already, and and while it may not be the the oh my god event that everybody's kind of been talking about, um, you know you still got to take these things seriously, and and um, it, it's going to be a snap freeze from you know kind of forty odd degrees to single digits in the space of a couple of hours. So things are not going to like that, and um, you know. Just, just do what, what, do what you have to do uh, to get get through this. Um, the irony is that on the other side, here at least, temperatures are going back up again to the sixties uh, in, in the weeks or so following as we as we move to New Year. So it's going to be like up 
tropical and we've gotten an extra heaters and fuel and gas and blah 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 everything under the sun i've got water stockpile behind me um just in case because i don't know who knows um and then at the end of it we'll come out of the side and be like well that was a waste of money we shouldn't have gotten blah 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 but you don't know what you don't know and if we hadn't done this and then it all turned turns to complete custard then we would be on the other side of the coin and that's just part of the whole preparedness thing is you have everything that you can possibly control or manage dealt with in advance and if you don't need it right this minute or this time round, there's always going to be another one further down down the line so hey this is just just life the universe and everything so Anyways, I'm going to cut it there and uh, get this uploaded and get on with my evening. Um, so yeah, you all take care. Talk again soon. Ciao.